In this video, I'm going to show you what a CSS declaration is, how to use it, when to use it, why to use it, and now you're going to know what people are talking about when they say things like CSS declaration. And we're getting started right now. Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab, where we help you code better so you can earn more for yourself for your clients and for your business. And if it's your first time here, make sure you hit the subscribe button, then hit the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome tutorials. And with that out of the way, let's head over to the screen capture so I can show you what a CSS declaration is. I'll see you there. I have a simple HTML page here with just a header tag, a paragraph tag, and this paragraph has an ID of transform. And I have a CSS rule up here where I select the ID using the hashtag and the word transform. I open and close the curly brackets and inside of those curly brackets I have one set of instructions and that is to text transform the text to uppercase. So it's gonna make all the letters in this, in the transform this text paragraph uppercase right here on the page itself, not in the code, but on the page itself it's gonna make them all uppercase. But this rule where it tells the browser to make them all uppercase, that is a declaration. And a declaration is made up of two components. There is the CSS property, which comes before the colon. And after the colon, but before the semicolon, comes the CSS value. So just to recap, a CSS declaration is made up of two components. The first one comes before the colon, and that's called the declaration property and the one after the colon, but before the semicolon is the declaration value. Now there are a lot of different properties for CSS, or so a lot of different declaration properties, and many of those declaration properties have multiple declaration values. But the point is this combination of a declaration property, a colon, then a declaration value, then a semicolon, that is a complete CSS declaration right there. And you can have multiple within a set of curly brackets. And in any CSS style sheet, you're gonna have many, many declarations. And so now when someone says CSS declaration, you know what they're talking about. And that's all there is to a CSS declaration. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, hit the subscribe button, then hit the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome tutorials. And make sure you check out these videos that popped up on the right so you can take your knowledge even further and until next time, keep crushing it, and I'll see you in the next video.